good morning everybody and welcome back to my youtube channel you know what i have been missing one key thing in my videos and that is telling you guys to subscribe comment like and share it's something i don't really i don't think i do as much as much as i want to because i just think like i mean if you like my content why wouldn't you subscribe <laughs> but that's just me so anyway i'm just here to tell you guys please like comment and subscribe share the videos and today i'll just be basically uh i washed my wigs two or three days ago so today i just want to like straighten them out style them and just like you know get them ready for whenever i need to go out because it's summer as you know summertime is here and when it's summer i really prefer just to like wear wigs it's better for my skin it keeps my my scalp clean it keeps everything it's just like the the pros are way more than the cons of wearing uh, a wig in summer so today i'm going to be showing you guys a video on how i style and um maintain my wigs and what i use so yes basically i'm just going to be straightening them and also seeing what type of styles fit the wigs now better than what they were in previous form whatever yes and guys i changed my bedding i just realized recently that um the beddings that i had i stayed with them for way too long but um even like these ones i'm also going to stay with them for a while you're going to see them in most of my videos but the thing is with me i wash them after every two after every two weeks like every second sunday so they're not really that messy and i'm a type of person that basically goes to bed after i take a shower so that's the setup this this is one of the wigs that's one of the wigs that's the other wig the other one is somewhere there so this is the straightener that i'll be using to style the situation so just a quick room update this is where i put my stuff those are just like my favorite sneakers but then the rest are at the under the bed mushwato and then yeah i don't know why this is looking like this because i just cleaned it the other day <laughs> Maybe it's because I use most of the stuff every day, like the mom rolls and the bath wash I will use every day. So, so that is the equipment that I'll be using to style the stuff, like a spray bottle and some coconut oil and hair food. I need to go get the hair food. Oh yeah, this is the other wig. Oops, this is the other wig. You see her? She's a body wave. I actually styled this myself as well. I I, I colored it myself she's just a body wave but I colored it myself and she's going to be transforming today I don't know if I want to keep the body wave as is because it looks really nice in its natural form I just need to like maybe amp it a bit or if I'm totally just going to change the style and straighten it because I really like straight hair this is the hair that I wear with my Oshikaiba and also on occasion that you'll find me wearing uh, uh, just like that. This is another. So as you guys already know I'm a strong believer in use what you have. So this is just the tripod that I usually keep my camera or my phone steady. My camera as if I use anything else. Um, keep my phone steady on while I record most of my videos and that's what's gonna be holding up the wig for me to straighten and style today So guys, I'm done straightening the bottom part of the hair. So because now my tripod is not is not cooperating, so I have to like put the wig on top of my head just to style the top part. 
so now i'll be styling the top part as you can see the hair is nice and straight the hair is nice and straight nice and silky nice and healthy so now i'll just be styling this top part in so, um, product number one is complete this is like a three-part lace frontal um but when i want to be really very really extravagant i like flip it over to the side and then it's like you know <laughs> more chica but this is my go-to i hope you guys can see yeah this is my go-to part in front like a young line there in front but yeah this is the the, the first one it's like done done first wig is styled and ready so this th this part is like this because my own hair is not braided down so once my own hair is braided down and then the the, the wig is gonna be laid and then I'm gonna add a little bit of I don't have a wax stick so I use like um, um a, a styling gel and then I just like straighten it in with the for the flyaway to just like for control the trick you guys should, you should try it if you don't have like a wax stick try styling gel and then you just apply it just a little amount just apply it with a comb and then you just straighten it through so this part is a bit bumpy like so because my own hair is not completely laid down so once my own hair is braided and then it's gonna be bomb bomb So, this is the second wig. This is how it's currently looking, a bit crazy. So, as soon as I'm done with the straightening part, I will show you guys and how I style it and what tricks I used. This is the second wig. Guys, as you can see, I'm not even halfway there, and the hair is already being stubborn. This hair is just stubborn. I don't know what type of women hair this is, but it's very stubborn. It's not like the, the other long wig. That one is like a nice proper great Brazilian, but this this one is Brazilian in my den. It's very stubborn. It's, it's not it's not it's not complying. This is what we need to pull off where I'm from. What do you guys call this? Where you are from. It's a mixture of um, Oros, Orocrash, Kool Aid, water, deep freezer. Basically, just an ice cube of flavor. What do you guys call it? Please comment in the description. Please comment in the comment section below and let me know what you guys call this. Bar Edem. Bar. My chat. But at the Twitter, I was a no Asia. That's not bad. Oh, and out of ten, I'll give it like a a six because I know she. What's that called? Marosaha. Probably a six and a half because it's it's, it's soft. I don't like eating ice cubes. It's an amazing marosaha. going on with the weather. 
like I said, this is the second the second look. What do you think? What do you think? I love this blonde hair. So flowy. This is the second look. You know, obviously when you're going out, you'll touch it up a bit, you know. Mm, put some baby hair in there. Put some baby hair of your own in there. And then to lay the flyaways. So the thing is, the problem with the flyaways is, I don't know, maybe the, when the hair breaks and then the flyaways are left. But even if you try and like straighten them and lay them down with a flat iron, it just... It just doesn't work. So I use that styling gel and I, you know, when you're going out, when you're going out, when you're going out, you use a styling gel, you lay it on, and then you just look beautiful. Like, hello. Me, and you want to She's She's she. I love the way I did the the color. The, you know the color, um, the color. I was I'm saying that I love the way I did the color of the hair because um, my I'm a natural brown. I think or like my hair is naturally brown. My just like brown. So or even darker. I think it's a bit darker. I think it's a bit darker. And the brown, the deep brown. So I wanted the root, the top roots or the top frontal to have a deeper brown, and then the blonde would fade in and out. As you can see, the blonde fades in and out. So the problem with this wig, the reason why it's like this, I didn't sew it down. So I need to sew it down so it can be laid like such. Because here. This part I didn't sew it down, so I need to sew this part down, and then the hair is gonna be laid like this. I wish I'd like Imagine if the hair is laid like this instead of this poof that has instead of this poof in the corner. So this is style number two. I only have three weeks, by the way, guys. I don't know why people make it seem like I have a lot of wigs, wigs. I have a lot of hair, but most of the hair is not on the wigs. Like I have another curl that's longer, but that one I prefer to get it on my head because it's so few. So I like leave I leave out a part or something like that. So I need an extra bundle for that one to put it on a wig. If you guys get what I'm saying. So this one. This one is this Mississippi. This Mississippi is like this. So with her, because I already like detangled this hair, it's like a totally, totally kinky curl. I detangled it already when I washed it. So um, I only use a little bit of water and conditioner. So just like get the bounce back. Oh, over the place. And the one thing I hate about this thing is the part is like totally invincible. The part is like invincible, invincible, invincible. I think I think I need to pluck it more. I think I need to pluck it. That's what I'm gonna do. I'm gonna pluck this part. So to style this hair, I have to get it like completely wet, completely, completely, completely wet. Um, I think I should move away from the water and uh, or water and conditioner treatment, and then I'm probably thinking of getting myself a styling mousse for wet hair look. There's this mousse that I saw in this was it this one or was it cosmetic? I think it was Cosmetica, cosmetic shop in Namibia, where. There's a styling mousse for this type of kinky curl hair so that because when when the hair dries out you see how how cute it looks when it's like this when it's like wet 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 when the hair dries out guys then the problem comes it becomes like frisk is it frisky or oh, 
electricity or whatever, the, the pearl just become loose. And it's not my favorite wig because it's so, um, uh, how do I say? It's like, like high maintenance or you need to like do a lot just to look cute and curly haired and fly all the time like the natural black goddess that, I'm, that I am. But you see, it looks so cute. It looks cute. But who doesn't want to look like this on a daily wage? Who doesn't? Who doesn't want to look like this on a daily wage? Don't you? <laughs> yeah, too much. Yeah. But it's it's too much. It's too much. Work. Imagine wherever you go, you have to wear the hair. Oh, what, what do you guys use for the hair? What hair look? Because me, I just use water and conditioner. And basically, it's just. Not it. it's, it's just not it. It's not. It doesn't really want to be. Continue to wet the hair until it comes to the standard of your liking, and then that's it. Completely styled. Then you put on a cute outfit or whatever. I like to crunch it upwards so that the curl just doesn't become extremely loose when the hair dries up, because this hair has a tendency of the curls becoming loose. I think it's the gravity, but I like the the hair like like so a bit so this is what I like my hair to look like to look good so when I wear this hair I usually lay my edges with like gel so that the hair can look like it's growing out of my scalp guys that's a secret so when you flip your hair your nyanya wrist does not show <laughs> You see, like, this is the reason why I style this hair last, because it's really not my favorite. I, like, this hair, when you're wearing the traditional attire, Mother Roshika Ibashwe, and you are just, like, slaying the slage of this hair with the traditional attire, guys. People will ask you, did you buy your hair? What is this really new? What is this? There's also the other way that you can wear the hair, with a bang. So the bang part, or you can just like open up the part in front that you know this looks so cute. There's also another way that you can wear the hair. It just looks cute. Yes. So there's also another way that you can wear the hair. See how it just gets like this this part i really 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 went to town and i made it super wet and this is the look that i really like often for, go for but this is how the hair dries out like this kinky um loose yes height. but this is the way i like it so i'm gonna try and see if i can find that loose that i saw at my friend's house and then you know slay the hair but i don't wear this hair often at all at all at all at all because i'm gonna you know because i really I don't want to replace it or when I'm like totally out of options because this hair is difficult to just go out in the streets with and just like be calm. <laughs> this hair dries like <sighs> so much. Why didn't I think about this earlier? Like, why did I not think about this earlier? Look at that. Straight. Straight, straight, straight. Even the, the, the bang itself is like all the way straight. 
Where was I? Where was I doing that? I was sitting on my brains, basically. That's what I was doing. What do y'all think of my wigs? Please leave a comment in the comment section and let me know how else you would like me to style them or you would want me to color any of them. Just let me know in the I will do that video. Yeah guys, that was it for my wig styling video. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Please, like I said earlier, Please, like I said earlier, do not forget to like, comment, and subscribe because I have noticed that um, people are watching my videos, right? Uh, you guys are watching my videos, but uh, the number of subscribers or percentage of subscribers that are actually subscribed to my channel is higher than those of you that are not. The, the, let me rephrase. The number of the percentage of people that are not subscribed to my channel but do watch my content is very high it's quite alarming to me because you like what you see you keep coming back for it you keep coming back and back and forth for it but then you're not subscribing why please do hit that subscribe button comment like share do all of that i think i should i think that i should make that my new anthem like all the all the youtubers now comment like share and whatever because the number of People that are not subscribed to my channel are extremely, 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 extremely alarmingly high. And I'm definitely going to take a screenshot of that and maybe put it in this video so that you guys can see for yourself that what is it that I'm not doing right and what is it that you guys want like from me? Like, why are you not subscribing? I don't understand. I don't understand. So please do go share with your sisters, aunties, and uncles to come in. Come and comment, come and like, come and tell me what video suggestions that you'd like to see more of. And guys, I have to sign out now because my butt hurts. I've been sitting on this floor for a while. I've got to go. Bye. <laughs>
ma mi iro matimo puonjore puonjore Thank you. 